genocide isn't like just murder. It is much worse than murder. Because murder can be one person taking violent and unjustified reaction against some wrong from somebody else. Genocide means I want to wipe out your life, whoever you are. I don't care who you are individually. I just care that you are part of this group. I want your life to end. I want your values to end. I want perhaps your language to end. I may want your religion to end. I want to wipe from the face of the earth everything that is most valuable to you. It is to wipe out not only your individual existence, but everything that you value. And that is the cruelest subjugation of all. And uh, I was privileged to live in a society where I could try to do something about that, not only to tell their, to tell their story then and to tell their story now in the book, but I went out every week into the countryside, all, and I would go out sometimes twice a week. I interviewed people who had suffered and who had been slaughtered and their survivors, and I would go back and I would give press conferences and I would call CNN or Agence France Press or BBC or whoever I could to try to get the story told because murderers don't like to have their identities revealed. Mm -hmm. And did I end the slaughter? No. But I could end it in that place for at that time. Mm -hmm. There were some lives saved because they stopped killing for a time. And every day I woke up and I just had two things in mind. What can I do to try to save the facade of democracy that still exists? And what can I do to save lives? And nothing else mattered to me.